it's Natalie. Welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be trying on a wig and giving my honest review on Lily Synthetic Wigs. Um, this is a company where you can get cosplay wigs and everyday wig. They're super affordable. The whole entire website, which I love. You guys know we love a good bargain. <laughs> and they were so kind enough to send me one to show you guys. So yeah, I'm going to be trying it on, trying to see what I could fix on it, if it needs to be fixed at all, and show you guys how I basically style it. So without further ado, let's just jump in with the video. Also, they were nice enough to give me a discount code. This is the discount code. I'll also have it in the down box below, and I'll also have the website so you guys can go check it out too. You guys know I love a wig. I love wigs. It's nothing new to my channel. I do wig videos all the time. I'm obsessed with wigs, I guess you could say. I just think they're easy and just throw it on your head. You don't have to damage your hair with heat or anything. You could just switch it up. Everyone likes little switch up. <laughs> So Lily Hair sent me the Alea wig. Yeah, I'm really excited to try it on. So this wig was originally $75. Um, they do have sales quite often, and you can use my discount code. Okay, so this is her straight out of the bag. Oh, there's like wiring on it. Okay. She's heavy. I wanted something completely different. I love, you guys know, I love either natural wigs or like, I used to have a blue wig and then now I'm like into this like silvery hair. Like what? That's crazy. Look how long. Ah. Okay, so I'm going to read you off what it is. So this is in synthetic hair, obviously. It's a medium cap size. It's lace front wig and uh, yeah, it doesn't say how much it weighs though. It's quite heavy. So I'm going to see. Okay, so I opened her up. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is the whole wig. Girl, what? So it has a lot of lace right here. Obviously, you cut this off once you put it on. But this is what it looks like from the inside. It has three clips, as you can see. And then it also has these, I call them bra wires. I know that's not what they're called. But they're like bra straps kind of and you put them in the loop just so it'll fit your hair, your head like a little bit better and it doesn't like fly off. Like if someone tries to rip your hair off, like it's not going to happen. It's going to stay on, you know what I mean? But yeah, this is the inside, the clips, three of them. I like how the lace goes all the way back and then it goes into like a U shape so you can like obviously change up the part if you want. Um, I like middle parts, so that's just my preference. But yeah, this is what she looks like. Okay, I want to try her on. A wig cap. I love wig caps. They also sent me... So when I put on wigs, I normally don't braid my hair. Um, I used to, but now I'm like, no one has time for that. So what I like to do is... I'm going to take off my hair. Take out my hair. So this is my hair. It's quite dark. I just showered. So it's not that greasy, I swear. It's just because I showered. So what I like to do is I like to take my hair, put it in a low bun, twirl it in the back. I know you guys can't see. But I just twirl it into like a little tiny bun, the wig cap, and just put it on. I do have dark brown hair naturally, um, so I'm going to see if this wig will like show it. I look like a lunch lady. Um, okay, so let me put this wig on. First, I want to adjust the straps just so it fits my head a little better. I do this with, like, all my wigs. Okay. Oh, lordy. Oh, she's cute. Hi. This is the extra lace. Obviously, you're going to want to cut it. I'm going to cut it off camera just so I don't mess it up. Um, so yeah, let me go do that really fast. Okay, so I'm back. So I cut the lace all the way, as you guys can see. I don't even know if you guys can see. But you guys see there's like no more lace at the top. So this is what it looks like when you like first get it. She's cute. She's full. She is really full. I'm going to brush her out actually. Um, I'm obsessed with like the curly like wavy hair. Um, okay, so she's not really shedding that much, which is really surprising because normally 
when you buy a like not expensive wig it tends to it tends to shed a lot and you guys can see like there's not really I mean it's shedding but not as bad as I thought it would wow this is like actually a really good wig I'm actually really shocked so she's really long too I'm gonna stand up and show you guys how long this wig actually is it has to be at least 20, 28 or 26 inches. I mean, I'll show you guys. Can you guys see? It's like all the way down. Like It's very, very long. I'm obsessed. I love, you guys know, I love, love, love long hair. Um, what I do want to do is I want to pluck a little bit just to make it a little bit more realistic. And I want to kind of frame my face. I love do. I need to stop touching it. I love framing my face when it comes to wigs because I feel like that's like a make or break thing with wigs. Like you can you could literally transform a wig with just like framing your face and getting it like a little bit trimmed. So that's basically what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and frame it to make it look. I need to stop touching my hair to make it look a little bit more not natural but less wiggy I guess you could say okay so yes this is a beautiful wig I'm gonna just take a thumbnail okay so what I want to do now is I'm actually going to cut the wig a little bit um just because this is what I do with all my wigs when I first get them just so I can be able to see a little bit more if I'm looking straight that's because I have a mirror behind my camera so I can see but what I want to do is I want to cut this hair a little bit just to make it a little bit more natural okay, so I have this I take my clip put it back okay now that I have it out of my face I'm gonna brush it a little more see where I want to cut it which I normally do these two front pieces um although they're beautiful I I cannot see that well so I just drag my scissors right across just so it kind of looks a little bit more natural so see okay this side I don't know if you guys can see it that well and this side I see a difference I don't know if you guys can but I definitely do and I'm not a professional this is just what I do clearly I'm not a professional I mean I'm just not okay here we go next side I'm just gonna take my scissors again. What I do is I twist it and then I go down. Okay, did like a little bit, but not as much as I want. I just literally keep going over it and over it and over until I get what I want. I just feel like if it's thinner in the front, it looks a little bit more realistic. That's just my logic. I just drag the scissors down. cute okay so now I have like little bangs not bangs but like a little fringe going on when I do wear my hair like this it's not like see this is what I don't like I like when it goes straight down so I'm just gonna take my scissors again and go back in and just cut it more down this wig doesn't really need much plucking I feel like it, it looks pretty good I am though going to cut a little bit more. I'm gonna let this hair down and just keep doing what I was doing, basically. Um, I'm gonna fix the part too, just because the part looks a little wonky to me. I wonder if you can apply heat to this hair. I don't know if you can apply heat, okay. There, I just fixed the part a little bit more. So what I want to do now is cut more. I just, I love wigs. I like how you can just switch up your whole entire look with just one thing. Like, it's just a wig. And then when you're done with it and you're sick of it, you can just take it off. It is getting a little bit tangly, but that's like what you get when you get a synthetic wig i want to get like this piece to like a little bit more cut i'm very like messy and carefree when i cut the hair it's just with like all my wigs i just didn't like that i'm like obsessed okay i think i like it just like this let me throw out all the hair okay i like it just like this i do want to try to put heat on it but 
I really like how the natural curl is like this. So obviously you can style it any way you want. I'm not sure about heat. If you do want to test it on heat, I would maybe do like a strand from the back so you wouldn't mess up like the whole entire wig. Like do a part where like no one really sees it, sees the hair that you're testing it on because if it fries like you can always hide it. You know what I mean? I'm going to do this and pinning it back. Oh my god, this is so cute. I think this is such an affordable, cute wig. Like, I actually genuinely think it. So, I want to show you guys how long the wig actually is. If I'm standing up, it goes to just about my hip bones. I think if I, would have if I were to straighten this wig, it would definitely go past my hips. This is what it looks like in the front. I did pin it back just because it was in my eyes. And I want you guys to see what it would look like. Okay, so this is it from the front. Curls, we love. Okay, and then this is it from the back. It's really long, like guys. What? How is this so affordable and so long? And the quality's good. And I feel like they have a lot of options for cosplay wigs, which is so cool. I think that's amazing. However, I'm not a cosplay girl. So the fact that they have like kind of natural wigs everyday wigs can i wear this every day i think i could if i really wanted to i think that's amazing so yeah i'm gonna try and straighten this to see how it looks just because i prefer more of a straight look than like crazy waves um so i'll be right back don't go anywhere and you guys will see the final result i'm back guys i straightened her and i'm obsessed She's so long. I, like, look, so long. Like, it literally goes past my hips, touching my thigh. Um, 10 out of 10, recommend you straighten yours on a low heat. I did mine for, like, 300. That was the lowest my hair straightener goes. Um, but you just kind of have to be patient to get the waves out. But guys, I feel like I'm a simp. Like is she uh and she's so soft like she's still soft i'm so gonna be wearing her out she's so long and i'm obsessed i'm so happy i straightened her y'all you don't even know all my wigs are straightened and i just i had to see if this one could be straightened because it doesn't say on the website but you gotta try you know what i mean so that's what i did um while i was straightening it did shed a little bit which is typical because it's synthetic, obviously. But for the price, guys, if I saw someone wearing this, I would at least think it was like $100. So long and so soft. Like, I can't stop touching it because it's so soft. I'm, I'm obsessed. I don't know. You guys tell me what you guys think. Um, I also did not glue the wig down. Obviously, you can if you really wanted to. I just, I normally don't just because I don't. I wear wigs every single day, but I don't have the problem with, like, them slipping or anything. I don't know why. Maybe I'm just blessed with a great head. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, guys, don't forget to check out the link down below if you want this wig or any other wig. I also have a discount code, which will be down in the down box below, so definitely go check that out. I highly, highly recommend Lily Synthetic, and thank you, Lily Synthetic, for sending me this gorgeous wig i love it so much but yeah that is it for today's video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys